Recently, the University of Pikeville's Tanner College of Dental Medicine received a $1.5 million grant from ARC to purchase new dental equipment. The equipment will be used in specialty clinics who serve low-income and special needs patients in eastern Kentucky. The purchased equipment will also be used to enhance the dental college's curriculum. The $1.5 million grant from ARC is going to contribute significantly to the development of our clinical enterprise in the new dental school. Uh, we plan to have a robust clinical facility uh, which will provide care not only in our student clinic, which will have about 72 operatories, dental chairs, but also we plan on having specialty clinics, an eight-chair pediatric clinic, and a five-chair clinic where we will serve individuals who have intellectual and de developmental disabilities. You want to save money and Appalachian Wireless gets that. Right now you can get up to $650 off select devices including the latest and the greatest on the Advantage Unlimited plan with a trade-in. Did y'all hear me? Up to $650 off select devices including the latest and greatest with a trade-in. <laughs> I'm not a math whiz but this deal it's amazing and you'll be on the region's premier network. We are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. See AppalachianWireless.com for complete terms and conditions. Some of the new equipment being acquired includes new dental chairs, radiology tools, and digital resources. Dr. Stein says getting new equipment wouldn't be possible without the grant money. Dental equipment is expensive. This will help us to pay for um, our, our equipment, uh, including the chairs and the cabinetry and the radiology equipment to take x-rays, and also digital dentistry so that we can provide state-of-the-art care for our patients. Uh, we, we will see probably in the neighborhood of one to 200 patients per day at this new clinic. We're gonna have, uh, provide a lot of care. And this uh, grant makes it possible for us to purchase much needed equipment. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.